okay and so uh, so the, this one is the uh, forecasting model of eq1 right the model is eq1 and this is the forecasting model and and this one yf eq1 it is passing by right here and here our forecast sample from 1991 until 2000 and uh, and you know there are many methods of evaluation of this forecasting there are many methods uh, but here out of many method uh, we shall be choosing uh, uh, as I told we shall be using root mean square error and tail inequality coefficient right we shall be using these two method to evaluate the forecasting okay so first I talk about tail first I talk about this one uh, root mean square error okay so lower the root mean square error better the forecasting okay oh, wow. what does it mean means that actual y and forecasted y these two series will be moving together that means the gap between actual y and predicted y will be small if the root mean squared error is small or lower I am telling again if the root mean square value is low meaning that actual y and forecasted y the, the gap between these two will be small meaning that forecasting error will be small meaning that that model is a good model and when the root mean square value uh, is high meaning that the actual y what is y here dependent variable actual y and forecasted y the gap between these two will be large meaning that our forecasting is not good okay that is the guideline number one then I talk about another evaluation tau it is here you can see root mean square is here and the value of this uh, model okay I'm just writing here I'm sorry uh, in case of EQ1 the value of root mean square is 3.69 3.69 right 3.69887 right so, okay I put it 3.69 so that is the root mean square of model EQ1 right and uh, and then what about the second one tile in equality coefficient you can see from here right we have we have one more method I'm sorry it's gone okay I'm making it big okay tile inequality coefficient is 0 0.1600 and bias proportion is 0 0.5487 right okay so first I talk about tile inequality coefficient till right till inequality coefficient which is u right which that is represented by u if u is equal to 0 
meaning that there is a perfect fit. So, perfect fit, meaning that actual y and forecasted y is same. That means there is no error. There is no error, meaning that actual y and forecasted y uh, will move together. That means they, they will become the same variable when u is 0. Okay. But if u is 1, then the, the predictive power of the model will be worst, right? So, meaning that u is between 0 and 1, right? u is between 0 and 1. If 0, then the predictive power of the model is the best. If 1, then predictive power of the model is the worst. So, uh, the whole thing will be between these two. Okay. In our model, what is the value of u in this eq1 model? We can see from here, it is 0 0.1600, 0, 0, right? So, you can see from here, right? So, meaning that this one is close to 0. This one is close to 0. That means the uh, predictive power of this model is strong. And uh, we can see also some more things. Bias proportion. Here is uh, actually tail inequality coefficient has three aspects such as bias proportion, variance proportion, covariance proportion. So, these three are the three aspect of the tile inequality coefficient, right? So, here we shall only check the bias proportion. What is the value of bias proportion? in our model okay bias proportion is how much 0 0.5487 right that means 54.87 percent that is the bias proportion uh, that means uh, this bias proportion is also called systematic error. Systematic error. It means that uh, it means that uh, the uh, that means the uh, the gap between actual y and the pred predicted y. That means in other way, the mean actual the gap between mean actual y and the mean of the forecasted y that is the gap right or bias bias between actual y and forecasted y so uh, so here the bias is very high 54.87 percent that means actual y and and the uh, for forecasted y they have big gap okay so what is the conclusion of, of this eq1 model in case of eq1 uh, i can do it here sorry in case of eq1 uh, what is the our decision of this model <coughs> 